have products that are beauty related, make you look and feel better, health related. They're all sort of lifestyle improving products. Yeah, I've kind of been an entrepreneur my whole life. I was raised in a family where we were taught to not be afraid to be entrepreneurs. We were forced to be entrepreneurs, kind of. But what I've enjoyed most about this particular entrepreneurial adventure is that we get to improve so many lives. I mean, we, we really do. It isn't just talk. We get to see a lot of lives improve because we try to improve lives with the products. We try to improve lives with the opportunity. On the back end, we try to have a culture of improving lives with your success for our distributors. We get them involved with us in doing some really spectacular things. We have a Nourish the Children initiative where we're giving food to kids. We've been able to deliver more than 200 million meals to, to kids in Malawi, Africa that would be dead otherwise. Very fun, but we're doing it in China and Haiti and all over, all over the world, wherever need exists, focused mostly on children. We've just been involved in so many fun things that you couldn't do if you were just a charity begging for money. But when you're a business and it's an integral part of the business, everybody's caught up in that culture, a really leveraged, amazing good occurs. It's been very much a team thing. There are no individual geniuses that have accomplished something spectacular here. But as a group, we're one really smart guy. <laughs> the more people you help to be successful, the more successful you are. The more people whose lives you improve, the more enjoyable the business is for lots and lots of people. Right now, sort of my goal looking forward is to double our size again, because that's gonna double the amount of good that we get to do, and that's why I'm here. Instead of cheating people and being mean, go out and do nice things for people. And in our business, it's been, it's been the magic that has driven us you know, through the roof.